back to my channel. I'm Katie, welcome if you're new. So today I've got so much Topshop stuff to show you, so many beautiful items and loads of their new stuff for autumn winter. So getting ready for your winter willies and how to pair them together with things. Everything in this haul is actually quite mix and matchy and you can sort of just, like I've got one pair of jeans you can practically wear with every single outfit, which is perfect for those of you that struggle to put outfits together. I've also got a skirt which is versatile with almost every jumper and probably every top that I that I bought as well. So ideal. Um, I've got a blog post coming up this week on my top eight favourite pairs of boots. I'll link everything down below. Every item will be linked down below for you to go and easily click on. If you are new to my channel then please remember to hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed this video and hit the like button. Also feel free to introduce yourself down below and say hello because I love talking to you all. Any questions please feel free to ask and let's just get into the video. So the first item I've got to talk to you about is this pair of booties. So I got these in a size 8. And I'm normally a size 7, but when I order online, I'm always a bit weary. And when I order from anywhere, to be honest, that's high street, or even designer, which I don't order from very often. But when I do, I always order size up for shoes, because I find they're making shoes very narrow fit these days, and I have to size up because of that. So I got these in an 8. They're £42. They're, I don't think they're real leather. They smell like leather, but I don't think they're real leather for £42. Um, they're a perfect just little Chelsea boot. They're very easy to wear with every single outfit like jeans, skirts, anything. They'll just go with everything in your winter autumn wardrobe. Ideal. £42 pretty much. I think it's pretty pretty good. You can get cheaper versions of these in places like Primark and New Look. So up to you if you want them to last. Like I had a pair from Primark last year. They lasted me for the whole winter for £8. But I tell you now they were like a suede they, they like marked with a few times of wearing them and they did, I felt really scruffy in them whereas I don't think these would mark because of the material too much, which is amazing. They were really hard to get on, but when they were on they looked really nice on and I think they're a perfect little buy ready for autumn winter when the rain starts to fall and you don't want your feet to get wet. So the next thing I've got to talk to you about is this adorable cream high neck roll jumper. It's so soft. And cozy I absolutely love this material the color is perfect and this is just such an easy to wear piece that's going to keep you warm and look so just comfortable but yet still stylish which is as I always say my best of both worlds um, this was only 30 pounds which I think is really good the quality and the material feels lovely feels really soft on it's got a little bit of extra detail which I like just around the arm bits and the high neck is quite high um, if you're not used to things up here then it is very high so just be aware of that. I think £30, I got it in a size 10 and it's quite wide as you can see. Um, but like tucked into a skirt or tucked into a pair of high waisted jeans looks absolutely lovely. You can mix this with black, you can mix it with denims, you can even wear it with a pair of white jeans. It literally is very versatile and very perfect jumper. This comes in a few different colours and all the colours will be linked down below in the description box. The next item I've got to show you is this little pink top. I thought this would be ideal for like little girls nights, going out for a drink, going to a nice bar, um, date nights, things like that. Just to dress up um, just a pair of jeans with, to be honest, and maybe like a pair of kitten heels or up to you really, boots if it's raining. Um, it's got lovely little frill sleeves. I like the pink colour. It's very like feminine and pretty and as you all know, pink is my favourite colour. The material is lovely. It's like a soft satin. Um, it's not actually satin. It's not that shiny. But um, it's really, really cute. It's got a little knot detail at the front, which I like. Just clenches you in here. Although I did find, I didn't know what bra to wear with it, so I just didn't wear a bra. And if you don't feel comfortable not wearing a bra, perhaps maybe skip this one. Um, but I did what I did like. It had like a little like clinchy bit at the back for the, for like just to hold you in a little bit. And I liked that. It was quite, just like sort of finished it off. So that was pretty. I got that in a size 10. And that fitted me perfectly. It was £26 and I think that's quite reasonable for what it is, to be honest. It's nice quality, it's nicely made and, yeah, definitely a winner. So the next thing I've got to show you is this dress, which is absolutely gorgeous. And I wish I had somewhere to wear it. Like, I don't really go on nights out these days. I'm just, I just can't be bothered for it. I'm just, I'm just getting too old. I don't want to be cold and I don't want to hang over. I, I enjoy a glass of wine, but... 
I wish I had some under this dress because it's really, really pretty and I think it'd be perfect for like a girls' night, a night out with your friends, anything like that. It's got absolutely gorgeous spaghetti strap detail on the back. I like the way the front is quite square. It's quite different. I've not seen many designs like that before. It's a nice length. I'm five foot ten and it's actually not very like not too short on me. I would like go for a little bit longer dresses these days, but I think this one you can get away with because of the colours just like quite pretty and feminine. It's not too tarty looking as my mother would say. Um, I got this in a size 12 because I think anything in a lighter colour like this kind of shows up every single lump and bump as we say. So um, just to keep it all a little bit more flattered and just to sit on top rather than to like hug you in. I got that one in a 12. It was £34 and I think that's absolutely like like a steal for £34 for a little night out dress which is as pretty and as like elegant and gaily and sexy as that. So nice little win there. The next item I've got to show you is this orange jumper. Now on the website it says red and I was a little bit disappointed when it arrived. It actually still says red here. It's not focusing. It says red here and as you can see this is orange and orange and blondes like I don't know how it doesn't look too bad there but personally I just don't think bright orange really suits me. Um, and I was gutted because I love red so much and I was like yes a nice chunky roll that red like quite a bright red because I feel like burgundy is very easy to come by but like an actual nice red is hard to come by in clothing so yeah I was a little bit disappointed this is £30 and it's the same as the white creamy one that I showed you at the start um, which was probably my favourite jumper from the haul the cream one I loved it um, so yeah I'm, I'm just a little bit gutted this isn't in red it's actually an orange but the fit again was lovely it's a little bit oversized but it the material is great and I think it's such good like value for money honestly like some of the stuff I've been ordering recently on these hauls I've been ordering from different various online retailers not necessarily high street brands and I have honestly noticed the difference in quality sorry I have to the difference in quality between the high street brands and the online brands for similar price really surprised me so I'll be really honest and the online brands that I've been been like doing in my hauls their quality for clothing isn't great and they're the same sort of price as high street brands now so I don't get how they're getting away with these things honestly because like this is such good quality and it's only £30 and I've ordered other things from other hauls that have been nowhere near the quality and very similar price so Topshop is doing very well on quality and price at the minute. <laughs> Okay, so I just said that that jumper was my favourite thing from the haul, but maybe these are actually my favourite thing from the haul. So these are mom, American, these are mom jeans, and they just go with everything. Like, they are really nice colour, blue, they just match, they literally went with everything I tried on, everything in my whole haul, I don't know if I did that subconsciously on purpose, or they're just that versatile, they went with everything. They are very snug on my thighs and my calves and I don't have the slimmest legs as such but I normally go for a size 12 in bottoms and recently I've been buying 10s everywhere and it's been fine um however these I got waist 30 which is a 12 and length 34 so for us tall girls the length 34 was great the length was perfect they were a little bit snug um like I said on the legs but I think with a bit of wear, I think it was just they were very stiff when they arrived. With a bit of wear, they'll be fine. And they're so versatile, I cannot not have them in my life. Um, I think if I went up a size, the waistband would be way too big. But there is another blogger that I follow called Catherine, Br Catherine Bond, I think her name is. And she actually did a tutorial the other day of how you bring these in at the back. Which was really, really handy and really cool and helpful. So if you... Let's keep going so bright. Sorry, it's like really sunny today. Um, she, yeah, she did that, so she sort of cut into the first layer, put a little button on here, put some elastic through the bottom, sewed that in, like I'd have to get my mum to do this because I probably could do it but I haven't got the patience, um, and then she, it just sort of cinched them in so it wasn't, like didn't have that gap at the back which a lot of us do have, so yeah, she's a really awesome person to follow as well so like definitely go follow her for fashion inspo, I love her page. Um, so yeah, these were a win. These, how much were these? These were £40, which I think, to be honest, these days is like pretty average for a pair of jeans, unless you're shopping in places like Primark, then obviously it's not. But like for high street brands, like 
River Island, Topshop, New Look, places like that, between 30 and 40 pound, I would say is about average for jeans these days. So with a pair this versatile, I just think 40 pound, you'll get so much wear out of them and they do feel really good quality. The next thing I've got to show you is this really adorable snakeskin bag. So as you all know at the minute, like snakeskin is very on trend. It's, well, all animal print is. It's like everywhere to be seen on every blogger, fashion blogger and blah, blah, blah. It's everywhere. And I actually really like it because I like all the neutral tones in it. Neutral colours are like my favourite things to wear anyway. So for me, it's just like adding a bit more into my life without feeling like it's a bit chubby, which it did used to be deemed very, very chubby. Um, I love the handles. How cute are the handles on this? has also got like an adjustable strap if you want to wear it over the shoulder. Um, however, I just think these handles are way too cute to, to bother with that strap. Um, it was £29. I think that's really reasonable. I mean, you're not going to fit too much in it. It's probably going to fit like your purse, your essentials, like your purse, your phone, your keys. And that's about it. You're not going to put much in there. But it is really, really cute. I will just dress up a little outfit for a night out. Or day, day outfit to go shopping. So, very easy to wear with, like, blacks, nudes, whites. Anything, really. I can't see this not going with. Um, yeah. I like that one. I really like that one. Surprised me. When I ordered it, I was like, oh, why did I order that? Like, I'm just going to come. I'm not going to really like it. But I really like it. Really like it. So, next I've got this really cute little pink top. So, I've kind of... I put this on my Instagram story and so many people, it looks like I've got a mark on it but hasn't, it's just a fold. Um, so many people were like, I put keep or, keep or, shall I keep this top I put basically. Um, and literally everyone voted yes, but I love it. Like I love how cute the little detail is on it, like all around the neckline, I love that. And I love the little detail on here. But I don't know if I'm fussed on the colour. Like. It's coming up quite light pink on camera, but it's actually more of like a mauvey pink. I don't know, I, I was like, I wish I bought it in white. So, what do you think? Let me know in the comments below if you think I should keep that one. I think that's just like a really easy to wear, perfect for autumn, winter top. It's gonna look great with jeans, um, high waist skirts, anything like that. It's only 12 pound, which is an absolute steal. And I bought it in a size 10, a size 10 fit lovely. The quality is really good, it's really thick material. Topshop is, I just can't get enough. So the next thing I have to show you is this really cute little frilly t-shirt. So this is only 16 pounds. Like, how is that only 16 pounds? It's really, really pretty. I got it in a size 10 and it fit lovely. I love a frill, as you all know. I just like the little bit of mesh detail on the sleeves, a little bit different. I think it's really pretty, really easy to wear. It just makes like an everyday t-shirt look a little bit more glamorous and pretty. So the next thing I've got to show you is this skirt. So this is a Johnny skirt. So if anyone knows the Johnny high-waisted jeans, like if you don't touch up at all, you'll know the Johnny high-waisted jeans. They were like really popular last year. Um, they're just a high-waisted pair of black jeans, but this is just a skirt version. So it's just a high-waisted black skirt. I got this in a tub. When I got it out of the bag, I was like, that's small. But actually now I've put it on. It, it fits fine. It's got like a stretch to it like the jeans do. It's very thin material which is good if you just don't want to bulk yourself out. £25 and yeah like I said I got it in size 12. Fits lovely. Perfect with this little crop jumpers tucked into it. Perfect with that top that I just showed you. Um, very easy to wear with like tights and boots or if you're comfortable getting your legs out just with a little pair of boots will look very very cute um, for autumn time before you have to get the tights out for winter and it's chilly and raining. <laughs> Okay, so the next thing I've got is this black body, and again, I wish I bought this in white. I really, really like it, and I, I like this on people that have not much boob. I wore it without a bra because I put it on with a bra, and at the minute my boobs are just—I just don't know where they've come from. <laughs> if that's even an expression, um, but yeah, I, so I put it on without a bra because I thought it made it. I don't, I don't have a flat chest, but it made me look more flat chested. I don't really like too busty things like. I don't know what it is, just as I get a little bit older, I'm just a bit like, mm, I don't just, I don't need to be all like, all bust entering the room first. I think I've said that in quite a few videos. That's how I feel. Um, it was £14, it fit lovely, it's a size 12, it's just a ribbed body, and it was really comfortable, really like good material, and I'm definitely going to swap this for a white, because I just know I'll get more wear out of a white one. I might even just keep the black as well. It was just such an easy wear. I wore it under every single jumper that I've showed you in the haul. 
um, and it's really comfy and you know when you just it's like that weather you don't really know what to put on so you put on a jumper and then you're too hot and you take it off and at least you've got something nice underneath rather than just like one of those crappy cheap strappy tops that we all used to have <laughs> So yeah, I like that one, nice easy to wear piece. Next, I'm gonna to talk to you about this jumper that I'm wearing right now. So as you can see, this is really just a lovely biscuity, creamy color. This is like super, super soft and super like cozy. It's a size 10 and it was 36 pound. This is a little bit more expensive than the roll neck ones. I wouldn't say I particularly prefer it. I find the sleeves, as you can see, they're a little bit short for me. Um, it is cropped, which I like, so you don't really have to tuck it in, but and I do like the colour, but I just think it's not particularly flattering, like it's quite wide and just like doesn't really do anything for you personally, uh, for me personally. So this is nice, but not my favourite piece. Um, I've got a few pairs of shoes to show you now, so I've shown you a pair of boots already, but I've got three more pairs of shoes to show you and that is it. Um, so these I kind of got from work but kind of got from every day as well. I really like these. Now these are real leather, they're wide fit, um, and again I got them in a size 8 and surprisingly they fit, like a wide fit 8, I'm not a wide fit 8, I don't know when that happened. They're really great quality, um, I love the detail on them, I think they're really easy to wear with absolutely any outfit, as you can see I wore them with a pair of the high-waisted mum jeans and I wore them with the body that I just showed you and that just looked really like effortlessly nice. Um, they're perfect for everyday wear, they'll keep your feet nice and dry and they're very very sturdy on the bottom. They were £46 which I think is a little bit more expensive but because they're real leather they will last you and you'll get the wear out of them to make it worth the while so that's them, they're really cute, very easy to wear like I said. Next I've got these boots for you, so these are got like a Bambi but they're all, almost like a sock style boot, like they're not because they're not loose here but to me they, they look like a sock, a sock style boot on because of the, the length of them. Um, they're really nice, they're very soft, I do fear with this material always that they will just scuff so easily. I like the pointed toe on these, I think it just like makes it a little bit more elegant, a little bit more glamorous. There's fluff on them. Um, yeah, so I like the little pointy toe bit, a little bit of extra detail. It makes them a little bit more something about them rather than it just being a boring black heel boot as such. Um, they do up at the back, which I don't think I've ever worn a boot that does up at the back. It was quite weird to put on, but they fit me really nice. They were a size 8 as well, so I, I honestly think in Topshop I'm just a size 8 shoe. Although I'm not a size 8 shoe many other places, they normally just flap off my feet. But they fit me fine. Um, the heel height is really nice for daily wear. You could also wear them with a pair of jeans in the evening to go out for drinks with your friends, to go out with a meal, for a meal even. Um, I know a few of you have said that you struggle with knowing what to wear to different occasions, so I'm going to do lots of videos coming up on sort of like styling outfits, how to put outfits together, what kind of outfits to wear for different occasions, what kind of outfits to wear um, if you struggle with like, like for example I'm tall and I always struggle finding things long enough for me, or if you're a short girl, I'm going to help you out as well and find things that suit you and suit your height, like things that come in with the petite and the tall sections because there is very limited stuff still for us tall and short girls. Um, so yeah, lots more content coming up on that sort of stuff, which is exciting. I'm really excited to get that all out for you. Um, I have a really exciting video coming up in the next few weeks as well. Different ways to wear a scarf. I've got this beautiful scarf. Um, yeah, I can't really say too much about that one, but... I'm going to carry on with the tour. I'm getting sidetracked. I'm too excited today. The last thing I have to show you is this adorable pair. I want to call them like Dorothy shoes, but they're not. They're just mules and they're red and they've got a little bit of like croc skin on them. And I mean, how can... I like really was a bit like, why did I order those? They're kind of out there for me. But I really like them and I feel like red is such a classy colour. And it's that really nice classy red. Um like it matches my nails look and I just I have nothing bad to say about them they're actually I will say they're a size 8 and my foot was hanging off the edge a time I don't know how I don't know how my, my foot could be hanging off the edge a tiny bit but it was so 
Um, other than that, they're £24, absolute bargain. They're really, really, really pretty. I absolutely love them, and I think they'll just dress up any outfit to make it so, like, effortlessly glam. You could just even wear these with, like, a black tea dress and a little red handbag, some red lippy, and it would just look effortlessly glam even though they're flats. So you could literally wear them with a pair of jeans, make an outfit look more glam. I was hoping to wear them with the red jumper, which actually turned out to be orange, um, but there we are. So that's everything I've got to show you today. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please click the subscribe button in the bottom corner. I can never remember. In the bottom corner of the screen, the little square here, or underneath this video. All the, all the links will be down below, like I said before. Please head over to my Instagram page and follow me on there for daily inspiration. I just do like daily fashion posts and lots of like feel good energy and good vibes. All the good vibes. So thank you so much for watching, like I said. Have a great day. Make sure you click subscribe. Leave me a comment down below and make sure you head over to my Instagram actually because I've got a competition. So, you need to head over to my Instagram to find out what to do for that, which is at Katie Victoria Holland. I shall see you next time. Have a lovely day. Love you all. Bye.